so i want you to share some of the tips from our viewers so that you know they can follow a very peaceful and healthy life sure 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 peace comes when we have faith and faith is only in the only stable entity we can't have faith in anything that is not stable so i want you to share some of the tips from our viewers so that you know they can follow a very peaceful and healthy life sure 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 um so uh, number one as i said is that um peace comes when we have faith and faith is only in the only stable entity we can't have faith in anything that is not stable and the only one who is stable only one who never changes the only one who is eternal is god and god can be in any form in any religion we uh, in india most of us actually worship various demigods and deities and they are all are manifestations of god they are different forms of god they are different uh, uh, powers of god they are different shaktis of god so we worship them in various religions they worship different types of uh, deities and all these finally they have faith and that faith is one most important thing to give us peace when we have peace our mental health is fine when our mental health is fine our physical health is fine and that was only found by ayurveda in the beginning psychosomatic nature of a disease so what is psychosomatic psychosomatic means a body and the mind being grouped together and that's when a disease is cured or formed when our body is fine that doesn't mean that we don't have any disease our mind also needs to be fine so these two together have to be coupled and therefore we need to cure us of mental diseases uh yeah we have to cure ourselves of mental diseases no one else can do it we need to stop uh disconnecting from nature because we are natural beings we are not made of uh we are not made of uh, the plastic we are not made of computer material uh, entirely and we are not made of microchips and chips and you know all these things in our brains so we need to connect more with nature and we need to uh develop a contact with uh any particular animal like cow or a dog not uh, not in an uh, uh, yeah yeah in an unhygienic contact but in a hygienic contact with these animals and uh develop an emotional feeling for them and not slaughter or kill or eat any particular animal as this increases our tamasic nature of our body not only that it makes us uh completely bereft of any compassion even to humans in the future so we need to become complete vegetarians and take care of every single animal as if they are our own children or parents for example at our home we have seven cows and all the seven cows we take care of just like our parents and our brothers and sisters and we also uh yeah we drink their milk and everything like that so we live a completely natural lifestyle and we would and and and, and also we love living that way and that's what everyone should try at least in a small way every day disconnecting from technology and connecting to nature is one of the most important things and also um uh, it is uh, immunity development and eating herbs for the good of the body etc so many things have to be done i've mentioned in my videos and the audience can refer to them also 